So guys, I'm in a train. It's so hot, they have no air condition here. I just opened some windows because, as I told you, I, in this unair conditioned trams, I just go crazy. I'm on my way home, it's like 9.30 in the morning. It was six, till I, oh, oh, it's three hours since I uh, video the first video. I'm going home because my dad didn't come home again, again. Because he's drunk, so fuck him. We don't care anymore, sister and me, we just go crazy. We, we can't deal with it anymore, you know. He's gotta leave or he's gotta straighten up because that's not normal. And going home to take care of my cats now and maybe buy something to eat and maybe cook something for my sister when she comes from work because she wants some things to eat that my dad doesn't know how to do so maybe I'll do it and as I told you it's so hot here it's like a tin can and you are in it and it's really not fair that he doesn't want to turn on the air conditioning because they do have it so you know fuck him but you know, I enter the tram dry and I exit really wet like a, I don't know. It's really horrible. And these are uh, air conditioned, the other ones, these ones, the new ones, and this old one is not. And uh, yeah, so yeah. So here is some scenic. So when I'm going from there to home, I go through this and my studio is on its way. And, but I'm not going to my art studio right now because, you know, it's just not uh, in my cards today. But they are doing works on the roads. And this is like a suburb, it's like the end of the city, so yeah. Nice. This is the station when I go down, when I go to my art studio, because my art studio is there, in that direction. But this is my bag. churches in my city and this is this one it looks like a fallen uh, spaceship and it's really ugly but we are still in the tram we have few more stations I'm going to the end and uh, then I'm gonna go to buy something to cook for my sister and that's it then home yeah. It's good that I opened the windows, it's kind of nice and breezy, but I'm still sweating. But I'm sweating bullets anyway, I don't know if it's the heat or the worry or the anxiety or the pain or the depression. You know, I'm going to the uh, endocrinologist on Tuesday, so we'll see what he says. They're probably going to be like, oh, there's nothing wrong with you, and I'm going to say, fuck, it is. And I'm going to scream if needed, because I need to know. If I don't know, what's the point, you know? It looks pretty, pretty desolate there, but it's not. There's a big lake behind there. And, uh, yeah, we 
it's a nice uh, tram, tram ride and you can enjoy it with me while I talk to myself and while I look crazy to people but I don't fucking care today because I'm, I'm very 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 uh, uh, anxious, nervous, depressed and quite angry actually very angry Sweating. That's a shopping center here. One of many, many, many. But yeah. And I got. I think I got four more stations to go. Yep. So this is the new skyscraper that I did, and it doesn't fit in this location, in my opinion. buildings from 70s and 80s and there are some from 60s will come to there I don't know <laughs> sorry so these are the buildings from the this is from the 70s and these little ones are from the 60s. <coughs> All of them. And there's a lot of parks here. Greenery. And I just drank some water and my throat kind of... <coughs> it kind of went in the wrong direction. So I'm out of the tram and I have a horrible hiccup. Mm. It's horrible when the water goes in the wrong pipe and then you, I guess, swallow a lot of air. You just go like hiccup, 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 hiccup and you burp sometimes. But yeah. Mm. I'm gonna go to the store and home, I guess. I hate hiccups. But there's nothing I can do. So I'm in the toy section, the store, just watching, just looking for some nice little toys to review or whatever. And there is not much, but you know, I'm just I'm just looking, and I'm still burping. So not burping, hiccups. I hate the hiccups, but you can't avoid it. When it starts, it will not go away. Ugh. So I'm out of the store, and uh, I'm so sweaty. I bought leaps for the stew that I'm gonna make or a soup, however you want it. And I bought some bagels and I bought one chocolate because it was sale. And uh, yeah, I'm going home now and just chill. I have to go to the pharmacy and then cook something for my sister and wait for her. She's coming home around three, so I have time because it's really early early it's not even 10 yet and I'm already dripping sweat and that's the worst thing about anxiety just sweating all the time without being anxious or maybe it's just inside of me and I'm just I just keep repeating it to myself and how do you say um, I don't know we'll see but yeah I'm on my way home. So this is the gym there down where I wanted to go but I don't have money for it now. Yeah. I wish I could go to the gym. 
and just lose my weight and be happy. Because when I was going to the gym, and it was like two or three years when, well, uh, uh, when I was going, it, it was like 10 years ago, but I was going for three years, you know, in a row, and I was in the best shape in my life. I felt so good. And, you know, I just felt good. And I, and I came to 79 kilos from 105. And I felt the best I ever felt. And now it's just shit. I don't know. I'm just flabby, soft, disgusting, hunched, and probably toothless soon and hairless. And that's how I see myself. I see myself as a golem from Lord of the Ring, like just declining in looks and power and destroying myself from inside, I don't know, maybe I'm just fantasizing too much, but it's strange, oh, this is an oak, and see how distracted I am, because of the ADHD, which I know how to control now, because I learned it from when I was a kid, but it still kind of takes your thought away sometimes from good things to bad things, or from bad to good whatever, but sometimes it just doesn't seem right to hate on yourself so much. I should, I should start loving myself again, and that's really not a possibility for me in this second right now. Yep. But it is a beautiful day. Maybe I'll go on a bike ride, I don't know. Maybe I'll just take a lot of pills and fall asleep. I mean, not kill myself, sleep. I don't know. Maybe I just play with my cats or... I don't know. Even if they don't want to play, they just sleep all day. <laughs> Crazy little... You know. Yeah. So, I'm just next to the pharmacy. I'm gonna buy some no nasal spray and... Yeah, I think I'm addicted to many things probably nasal spray because I really need it every day but then again I do have I do have uh, problems with my sinuses so I'm not sure then my muscle relaxers I don't know maybe maybe not I mean my psychiatrist says that I'm not but who, who knows Maybe I'm just crazy. And then when I say that, he says I'm not crazy, which I hate. Am I crazy? Am I not crazy? What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? My brain is just like a stew, just like going all the way around, full of vegetables and fruits and spices. Oh, I'm crazy. I'm going nuts all the way. This is a doctor's office, but not mine. Even if I do live much, much more near than my real doctor. And right now we're going to the pharmacy. You, oh, I don't have a mask. Okay. Well, we'll go with a tissue. So, I'm on my way. I've been to the pharmacy. I went to the store again. I bought some more veggies. I bought a Coca-Cola, which I shouldn't be drinking. But fuck it today. I need it for my brain. My brain function functions are low from not eating any sugar for almost half a year now. So, well, it is over half a year. It's what, six, seven, eight, nine months. Yeah. And this effing heat wave doesn't help at all. It's just worse and worse. And next, next week it's gonna be like the worst. So I'm kind of scared, but yeah, we'll, we'll get through that, I guess. <sighs> I don't know. It's a bad time to live in Europe right now. So I just took some cat grass, which is really nothing almost. There's nothing grows around here. I mean, it, it, it does, but they cut grass all the time. And here I am. My building is there, so, yeah, I'm just going home and 
Thank you for watching. Subscribe, like, and share this little out and about thing that actually did nothing but listening to me talking like a crazy person. Okay. But here we are, and here's my building and. Love you guys, talk to you soon and yeah, bye bye.